Are you ready for more extreme trading? Extreme trading. Trading even in the dreaded no trade zone, the DMZ, the demilitarized zone, where there's no, no clear direction between the Red Army and the Green Army. Watch this. We checked the six hour. People are getting liquidated. We don't really have clear direction. What do we do? Well, first of all, I just went shopping. and left this trade in. Now, I might make this just for my Discord people, I might make it public. While I was out, the long, let's go to open orders, you can see the long anti-liquidation did not, well actually the long fired off, the short did not. The long is in profit, this means you would have been liquidated in your long position. Now. Why would I close the long here? Because I'm up 35%? No, that is not how you make decisions, okay? Look where we are in the one minute. We're pretty much at the bottom of the one minute chart. So we are not gonna close this because it's up 35%. We're gonna close it when this starts to run up green and this runs higher. And then we're gonna sit and wait. Mm like wolves hiding in the woods. And we're gonna wait for this to go green because we know in a no trade zone, it just swifts back and forth and on the one minute, it just pumps and dumps. And the stupidest thing you would ever do is close both positions and break out even. We are here to win a strategy of winning. See, we wanna close this not on the percentage, but on maximum green run up on the pump and we have anti-liquidations in here to protect us. In case this gets blown out, we will not let this blow out. We'll protect the position. There's no real clear direction yet. We got a Caitlin going on the six. Okay, so at this point, we're gonna close it. Okay. Just gonna close it. Current price, current price. Look at what we got, 1.058. Current price, current price. Boom, hit it. So we closed our winning short. We made some money. And now we hold out in the losing position. We get rid of this. Now we wait. We put in another countermeasure. We're gonna put that in at 79 limit. Okay, 0.301X. $10 away, so 927, so if it gets to 937, 937, this short will be protected. What the hell did I just do? What did I just do? Duh, I entered a short, dummy. Close that right away. That costs you money when you make mistakes like that. We are looking to protect the long. Okay, point three. If this drops to 937, you see you gotta double check your work. Double check what you're doing here. There you go, that's proper. Now, we have a predominance of green, even though indecisives. So we hold and protect this position. It's all about adding to profit. Now when this pumps up, when it pumps up, since we're still in a no trade zone, if we stay here, we go ahead and we enter another short. The one thing we're not gonna do is add to a loser. You never ever do that in leverage trading. I hope you found this helpful. I'll go more and more into finding foolproof strategies to keep you from getting liquidated, to keep you from losing money. All we care about is making that money, baby. So we got out about here, a little bit more downside and a pivot. Profit is profit is profit. Look at this. What if it flips to the upside now? 
you're gonna see a green candle here. If this continues, we're waiting, letting it form. We got a flying Caitlin. We don't know what it is. There it is, the weak correction. Another perfect execution. I will stay in this trade until I win and manually adjust these back and forth until we have clear direction. I will continue to find a way to suck money from this market. No TA, no nothing. The closest thing I get to TA, aside from Hooters, is the six hour chart and hiking a sheet candles, my friend. No indicators. Mm -hmm. And in two days, I'm gonna sell my 2019 Lamborghini. And then once I sell it and I no longer own it, it's no longer a security risk to know exactly what I drive. And I am going to do an unboxing video of a brand new Lamborghini. Subscribe, share this video with friends, tell them there's hope. Boom. And plenty of money in this wallet to protect this position no matter what. And it will reverse the one minute only pumps and dumps. So let's go get it. If you want to see my brand new Lamborghini unboxing and how they deliver it to your house, tell me in the comments. I'll show you what it's like. I'll take lots of pictures now before I sell it. I've had it about I think I've had it five months. Wrote a check for it. But now I got my sight set on a new beast. A new beast. There's going to be a new beast in town, baby. May not be a Lamborghini. Maybe it's just an average Joe car. Maybe it's a Nissan Quest. Maybe it's a new Corvette. Nobody knows round and round it goes. But the one thing you should do with your money is enjoy it. Just like I was think, talking to this girl in the elevator, she was with her family, and she was talking about some new luggage she wanted to buy, but she's like, oh, it's really expensive. I should buy a condo first. And I looked her in the eye. I was like, you should just have fun with your money. And she's like, you're so right. I was like, let's go have fun, baby.